Well, know, Pete, we talked the other day about, you know, Delaney Snyder and what you had to do to stop her. Three goals in ten minutes. That had to be shell-shocked. Yeah, I mean, she only really scored one one of those goals in the run of play. I mean, she, you watch anyone who watches this game, she's an absolute phenomenal player. I'm going to guess probably one of the best in the state, and she could do that to just about any team, no matter how you mark her. She's very explosive. She's very talented. She's strong, and she never stops working. Well, just you had to be that the most nightmare situation to be down 3-0 10 minutes in and really kind of be out of it at that point. I mean, yeah, that's not the ideal situation to put yourselves in in a state semifinal game we talked. I mean, didn't want to go down one nothing. It's tough to come back from that in a game like this. But we actually didn't stop fighting. We didn't stop working. We continued to pressure, and we got one back. And at that point, if we just got it, could have get, got another one quickly, we would have been right back in the game. How, oh, go Coach, what do you see out of this team as you guys now reflect on the season, kind of what they were able to do, taking another step further than last year, and kind of still a younger team in a sense, only using a couple? Yeah, I mean, what this group accomplished from last year is absolutely incredible. And you look back at what our seniors accomplished over their four years here. First in the state, second or second in the state, first in the state, top eight and top four. So, I mean, it's very impressive. They're good leaders for this group of young girls, so I couldn't be more proud of them. Yeah, you're good right there. To be down three nothing, what was going through through your mind and to know ten minutes in you were down three goals already? Well, honestly, we are kind of known as a comeback kid, so I really wasn't that worried when it was uh, three nothing. But then, you know, they scored a couple more, they scored a couple more. But uh, like I said in uh, the other day, our team has a really uh, positive attitude, so we just kept working and tried to get a couple more goals. So we didn't give up even would, at the end. What was so difficult about defending them, especially Snyder? Um, well, number 24 is really fast, and they they move the ball very, very well. And we try to play more offensively. We try to attack with all 11, and so did they. And they just did it a little better today. You had to feel like you get the goal back. It's 3-1. You had to feel like there was there was some hope there to start. You know slowly getting that comeback going did you, did you feel like that that was you know there was an oh, opportunity there yeah when uh we scored i thought that we had a chance to get another one or two more but unfortunately we didn't but like i said before we worked hard till the end so that's all that matters although this isn't the result you guys you guys wanted what would you remember about this group and just you know obviously this team the way they fought this year um well one of the nice things about this team is whether it was a practice even on a friday or a saturday morning practice we gave 110 percent and everything that we did we gave 110 percent until the end well, you get the goal to make it 3-1. What was going through the team's mind at that point? Did you feel like there was a comeback in this team? And how deflating was it when they scored just a few minutes later? You know, it was really upsetting in the beginning that we were down. And, you know, just to get the goal for my team and to be able to bring them all up. You know, we're, we're known for comebacks. And, you know, I think all of us were thinking that we could come back into the game. And, you know, I think we did for a little bit. And we possessed the ball really well. And, you know, it was unfortunate that we couldn't get back into it. But I think together as a team, we did possess the ball and do really well. What was it the first 10 minutes that they were able to do that really seemed to overwhelm your team? Well, I think their girls are a lot bigger than ours. And they scored on four corner kicks, which really put us down. And, you know, they had at least girls that were two feet taller than us that could head the ball in the back of the net. And I think that really put us down a lot. But... You know, as a team and working together, I think um, we brought each other up even though we were down, and I really wouldn't want, want to be on the field with any other girls. You know, we always put 110% in at the practices oh, and careful. the games. <laughs> <laughs> um, but yeah, I wouldn't want to be with anyone else in the field.